Overindulging during the holidays in the last 10 months of this pandemic have many practicing a dry January or a well needed break from booze and for others who may struggle with addiction, it can be very difficult for them to get a fresh start because of some of the stigmas that surround substance abuse. Here this morning is former corn guitarist Wes Gear. He's also founder of the nonprofit Rock to, Rock to Recovery, and he's getting behind the Get Lucid Challenge. Welcome to the show, Wes. Hey, thanks for having me. Talk about first the stigmas that are associated with addiction that prevent a lot of people from getting the help that they may need. You know, it's interesting, even as much as we talk about addiction and mental health today, so often people who are struggling with drinking too much or using drugs feel like they're so different, like nobody understands them, nobody gets them, or they bring a lot of shame and guilt into this concept of having this problem. And uh, what we know is it's a disease. You know, the medical uh, profession, you know, has, has treated um, addiction and classified it as a disease. So we really need to treat it like anybody who's sick just trying to get better. Mm -hmm. And so by talking about it, the more we can talk about it, the more we can create normalcy, if you will, the same we would talk about heart disease or maybe being overweight, we can start removing the shame and the guilt that comes along with it because it hides. Addiction hides in the corner. You know, somebody who's suffering from addiction or mental health, maybe nobody knows about it. If you're overweight, people might see it's very open uh, that you might be struggling. So we want to bring this to the light and have it be a comfortable place, as hard as that may seem to conceive, uh, to talk about addiction and mental health struggles. So we mentioned the Get Lucid Challenge. Can you tell us what that is and why it's so important? So Lucid App is an app which is, uh, is an online uh, recovery community. They have you know uh, chat rooms and all sorts of resources and events and even dating on there. Uh, because the opposite of addiction is connection. This is what we know now. And so the Get Lucid Challenge is something where we hold up three fingers to signify what uh, Lucid has uh, deemed the three you know, major blocks to getting into recovery, which is that uh, addiction is about willpower, but it's really not. There's a powerless element to it. Um, so uh, willpower and just being strong enough to not drink or use uh, is is a stigma we want to break down. And also what we were talking about a moment ago, which is the stigma of shame and guilt and feeling like a mm -hmm. bad person if you're struggling with addiction or mental health or, or anything. You're not a bad person. And most importantly, this is the crazy thing. Mm -hmm. I was out touring with one of my old bands, killing myself with my addiction, losing, you know, my cars are repoed. Nobody wants to talk oh, to me. And I'm thinking, and I was thinking, but if I get sober, my life's going to be so boring. It's like, dude, your life is a living hell right now. <laughs> and so what we learn is, and what we want to destigmatize as the third thing, is that the fun isn't over when we beat addiction, when we beat mental health challenges, or any demons for that matter. And, you know, um, I'm here in large part because I got the corn gig because I was sober. So where I thought music and fun was going to be over if I let go of the booze and the drugs, what we find is that there's this whole unimaginable, amazing part of life that, that breaks open for us when we let go of the things that are holding us back. And I just want to add one more thing is that usually addiction and drug addiction and alcoholism, that's a symptom. The using of the, uh, of the mm -hmm. you know, drugs or alcohol is just a symptom. It's really usually attached to an underlying mental health issue. And so once we transform and become a better person, the sky truly is the limit. I hear you, Wes. Thank you so much for sharing some of your story. Best of luck with your Rock to Recovery and helping out with the Get Lucid Challenge. You can join in and learn more about it at lucidapp.com.